been a season of mixed emotions, obviously. Not the season we all wanted, but we did stay up in the end. But for you, two player of the year last night, players play the main one. What are your feelings? Um, yeah, I'm obviously delighted with the awards. You know, it has been a difficult season. It's not been a good one uh, for myself, the football club, really. But we did uh, achieve our championship status in the end, which we all wanted. And um, you know, now we can go away, have a good summer, and see what next year brings. You've always voiced your opinions. You were quite philosophical on that stage. Yeah, and I th I did, you know, my my uh, my mum and my missus said tonight to lie, really, because. If I was to be up there speaking the truth, then this day and age, there's not a lot of people like hearing the truth, um, especially to the faces. And, and I've always been one that if you get, ask me a question, you're going to get an honest answer. And, um, you know, people might think that I've said a few things about the chairman there to, to make it easier for me to get a contract or to, to leave on a, you know, his good side. But, you know, at the end of the day, I'm just being honest. And, you know, I know how I work, how this football club works. And, you know, we shouldn't have had a season like we did this year. Given what we've achieved in the past, you're, you're quick to compare it to previous dressing rooms. Yeah, and it's hard to do that because you know you've got to let things go. Yeah, you know the, the success we had there under Ian Holloway was, you know, probably the biggest thing I'm going to ever do in my career. And then players at that time, like I said before, it was very special. Um, but you have to move on from that. Um, been disappointingly this season, we haven't, um, you know, and we, we, we did let a lot of good people go, and, and I've said that before and I mean that by good people not just good players but very good people who understood how this football club worked uh, so to replace them was difficult as players but uh, as people again was even more more, uh, more difficult Going back to these awards how much do you think that save at Wigan helps weigh the vote? Um, probably uh, but you know everyone said it's kind of saved the season um, but you know over 46 games I can't see how one on save can really define that but you know, I, again, and I've said before, I'm doing my bit for the team. Uh, it's a squad game. And, um, you know, thankfully that day that we had Andy Keogh and Stephen Dobby to score the two goals that, you know, got us a victory. So I'm just doing my bit in the team. End of the season brings parting away for several players. It'll be a complete rebuild again. Is it just a case of going away now and seeing what happens? Yeah, it's for me. I think I'm going to, you know, go away Wednesday. I'm going to have, I'm going to turn my phone off for a couple of weeks. Um, let me agent do all the talking. Um, we'll see what happens. Um, you know, I've obviously there's no one to talk to me at Blackpool uh, about my future. Um, but like I say, you know, I'm going to give my body a chance to have a rest, stop taking the tablets, and uh, get a bit of sun on my back.